All right, we are in a brand new TKE elevator machine. Now these used to be some 1970s Dover um, computomatics or composites. I forgot which they were. That was years ago when I was last up in here. I lost all the footage. Probably one of my biggest regrets now because these are completely modernized. This is the service elevator machine. This is on an OEM TKE machine, SC400. Brand new. See, big old disc brakes on it. It's your sheave motors back there, um, blower. Some pretty impressive equipment. These are governors. 350 feet per minute on the service car. Normal one. Are these all 350? Um, have to do more looking, but um, here's the regular car machines. These all use in tour and drive machines. Kind of odd. This is a TK install. Here's your data plate. These machines are very compact. So brakes, like emergency brake and a normal brake. Yeah, synchronous elevator traction machine. 1.02 meters a second. Tis and crop. <laughs> See, look at the uh, remnants of the oil from the old gearboxes in here. This used to be geared. Some uh, high rise building, nearly 20 floors. I love the brake sounds on these. Oh, hello there. Awesome. Let's watch this machine go. Very high pitched um, sounds. Very high pitched sounding. The drives on these are kind of loud. Here are some more of the regular elevator car machines. Those brakes sound nice. Tech 32 T, um, T controllers. So, the peak inside. So, see. All basic info. It's the actual control part, it's the brains of everything, the actual micro part. 350 feet per minute. Here's um, a UPS down there. Contactors, VFD, and that's the UPS backup. It's a battery backup for the controller. If we can. Hold on a second, let me resume the video and pause it. All right, here we go. Back here is um the there's your VF drive right here, green AC drive. It's all your connections. Siemens some um, contactors down there. Breakers. Very nice equipment. All right, let's close it back up. Also got brand new air conditioners. <laughs> Has this one already got a fault code? That's great. They installed these on before the mod, so these already got a lot of carbon dust on them from pre-modernization. No regroove. Great way to earn some more money, TK. Not letting people regroove it.
take a look at the service elevator's VFD, it's going to be different. So a lot of airflow coming from here. These ACs are probably overkills they were spec'd for the old equipment, pre-mod. controller for the service car. See it's going right now. has a higher capacity as well, has a, a larger um, motor. I wish they used all TK motors on these. The torn machines, I've seen so many pictures of them all torn apart, needing major motor work. If these were 219 HT machines, let those things run 100 years. In fact, I've seen over 70, um, series 70 machines over 100 years old, type 70, I bet. Back here, see inside the motor, the windings. These are made in Germany. See your diagrams for it. Test and crop. This is where on the part of the old HVAC was for this machinery. Just realize how long this video is getting. <laughs> Scared me a little getting pictures, that's why I keep walking around the machines like this. Oh yeah, service elevator with VFD. Let me pause the video so I can open it. Here we go. Not much different. Definitely um, looks like it's larger. The other one said 30 HP. This one says 40 HP. It's a bigger machine. service car. Now we're getting some action out of this. All right, now that will be it. Long video, a lot of detail, but this is epic.